At least 70% of the quality of our lives is significantly influenced by one simple element. The simple element that profoundly permeates almost every aspect of our life, but is most times overlooked and taken for granted. The quantity and quality of this simple element in our lives directly affects every aspect of our being, influencing physical and mental health, productivity, and even mortality. In contemporary times, there's much concern about what one should or shouldn't eat. Quality of food no doubt affects and reflects the quality of life. But whether vegetarian or carnivore, the one simple element that is absolutely fundamental for all bodily function and well-being is water. Pure water. Think about it. The human fetus is 99% water, and the newborn child is 90%. Before we can even begin to traverse Maslow's hierarchy of needs, there are three things that we absolutely need. Air, food, and water. You may make it for more than three weeks without food, but you'd be hard-pressed to make it past three to four days without water. And the relationship between clean water and good health, though obvious, is often completely overlooked. The quality and quantity of water in your life significantly affects every bodily function. All over the world where clean water is abundant, quality of life for all things thrives. Conversely, when there is a lack of clean water, quality of life for all things declines. There is no substitute for water in any of its functions. It has as important a role in the health of the planet as to the human body. No water means no life. In the United States, the general perception of water purity is in need of a serious readjustment. Over the past five decades, our environment has drastically changed. The patterns of disease have also profoundly changed. All around the world, diseases in children are substantially increasing. And at the same time, more than 80,000 new chemicals have been developed and released into the global environment. In the wake of these unfortunate realities, there are a few questions which seriously need to be addressed about drinking water in the United States. Last year, $11.8 billion was spent in the U.S. on bottled water. In the aftermath of the West Virginian chemical spill of January of this year, 300,000 residents were dependent upon bottled water. Within the first 30 days, the state spent more than $900,000 on bottled water. In August of this year, 600,000 residents in Toledo, Ohio were told not to drink the water as a result of an algae bloom and were dependent on bottled water for a week. Bottled water makes sense at the outset of these tragedies, but makes no sense on a long-term basis. This campaign serves to empower you with need-to-know information about the value of clean water and the best way to clean your water, especially during times of an emergency. FEMA and the Red Cross recommend only three ways to purify water during an emergency. Boiling, chemical disinfection, and distillation. Unlike filters and other membrane technologies, nature's hydrologic cycle, evaporation, condensation, and precipitation is a huge non-barrier solar thermal cycle that consistently produces pure water. Steam distillation systems mimic nature's hydrologic cycle. It is the only treatment process that first boils the raw water and condenses the pure steam to form very high purity drinking water. The absolute best protection from contaminants. It is the single most effective broad spectrum core method of water purification, consistently producing high purity drinking water year after year, saving both money and the environment. It costs less to install a pure and secure water solution in every school, daycare center, community center, and hospital affected, which would ensure water purity while simultaneously preparing them in case of a future emergency. This campaign also serves as a call out to all pure water warriors in the making. Water quality significantly affects a child's developing brain and nervous system. In reality, every school, particularly schools affected by environmental toxicity, need have a pure and secure water solution. So let's change the world and bring pure water to all the places of refuge, to all the schools, to the daycare and community centers, to the hospital, to your office, to your home.